Edmund Fredericks, who bought up tax uh, land in the Babylon area and uh, for tax sale, and then he would he would sell it, he would resell it. So they they bought several lots from Cadman Frederick, and I guess his gimmick was you didn't get the deed until you you was paid in full. So if you didn't pay, you took it back and sold it to somebody else, I think. <laughs> but they bought. I, I I was thinking. I think it's five or six lots that they bought, uh, and then they they. Um, we would, this was, I guess, the late 30s, and then the early 40s, um, when family owned this, this plot of land, we would um, drive out on weekends, well, mainly on Sundays, and we would spend the day there. We would picnic and, you know, kind of walk around and look at this vast piece of land. There was nothing on the property at no, the time? No. There was one grassy area, which we took advantage of, because everything else was scrub pine and oak and, you know, all the, every, every, pretty much very overgrown. But there was one corner that was, was, there were some cherry trees there, the little tiny cherries, not the kind you could eat. Uh, and there was this grassy area, so we would drive out and we would picnic there. And then at the end of the day, we'd go home.